guys, Rachie Bop here. Welcome to today's episode of Ask Rachie Bop. For Apple snaps, an iPhone theory, and talk of how your life can change with Siri. Into the Sims, but there's real life too. She loves to answer questions from all of you. Ask Rachie Bop. I've got four set of questions this week. Um, I try to take 10 each week, so if yours doesn't get answered, don't worry. You can ask again for next week and it might get answered. I'm not ignoring you. I just like to keep these videos to a certain length and answer a certain amount of questions. I'm still a little bit full of cold. Tried to fight a sneeze right now. The first question this week comes from Zacardiero99. Seasons or university life? Well, that is actually a more difficult question than I thought it would be. I really, really like university life and I think it, it brings a whole lot of stuff to your game. But having said that, I can't imagine the game without seasons now. You forget how much underlying background stuff you'll constantly have because of seasons. So I'm still going to say seasons. Next question comes from at Kevbro98 over on Twitter. Are you looking forward to the time travel expansion pack for The Sims 3 coming up? If so, do you think you will enjoy it? Um, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to that expansion pack. We don't know much about it yet, but I imagine it's going to be awesome and definitely way different to anything we've got at the moment. The next question comes from Derek Sturgill here on YouTube. What do you think Sims 4 will add to warrant it being a sequel, like Sims 3 adding an entire neighbourhood? I actually think it's going to be a completely separate game, I imagine, like Sims 2 was from Sims 1, Sims 3 was from Sims 2, Sims 4, this is how I picture it. It's going to be better graphics, it's going to be very much online like SimCity, it's going to allow us to interact a lot more with each other and send Sims and come and look in on each other's places and worlds and it's, I think it's going to be very different from The Sims 3. The next question comes from Sims Rock 6. What would be your perfect night in? Hmm, it depends what mood I'm in really. I kind of would just, like I really enjoy nights where I can just watch American TV shows or reality TV and just maybe snack on things. The next question comes from Harry Strachan here on YouTube. What's your favourite brand and colour and will you please give me a shout out? My favourite brand, I think the most obvious one for me would be Apple. My favourite colour probably would obviously be pink but actually it's purple but I think it's probably evolving into pink. And here's your shout out. Harry Strachan! The next question comes from Build a Bear and More. What was your favourite TV show as a child? Definitely Willa the Wisp. <laughs> love Willa the Wisp. Still love it now, but not the new one. Next question comes from Molly Noon or No One. I do have no idea what if if you've done that as an as No One or if that's your surname and it's Noon. I I I don't know and I don't want to insult you. I just people yeah. Sorry. What kind of computer do you use for your Sims games? I use my computer that I use for everything. It's a HP TouchSmart 600 PC. The next question comes from Maya M. What's one city in the US that you haven't been to that you're dying to visit and have you visited the Mall of America in Minneapolis MN? Um, one city that I've been dying to visit. I can't really think of a city that I want to go to that I haven't been to. Um, not a city. I know I, I would really like to go to Yellowstone. I haven't been there. Um, but not a city. I would really like to go to Mount Rushmore, I've never been there, not a city. And I'd really like to go to Rachel um, in Nevada, just because, an Area 51 and things. Again, not a city, sorry. 
And uh, I've never visited the Mall of America. I've never been to Minneapolis. I don't think. I may have travelled through, but I've never been. The next question comes from Shauna Firth. Are you against bullying? And could you give me some advice for me and other people who get bullied? And yes, I watch your videos because they make me feel happy. Oh, I'm glad my videos make you feel happy. I'm definitely against bullying. I can't imagine anyone being for it. I guess the bullies are, but they're idiots. And bullying, I don't know, really. I mean, it's easier. Th any advice I give you is easier said than done, really. It's anything. You just need to be positive, ignore them, rise above it. Um, try not to let them get to you, talk to your family, talk to people around you, just try and stay positive and ignore them and don't waste your energy retaliating, just move on. The next question comes from Connor Does Gaming. Hey Rachie Bop, and this is the final question, it's quite a long one. Hey Rachie Bop, I was thinking about when my iPhone 4S contract ends, what phone should I get? I'm thinking of leaving iPhone and going for a Samsung Galaxy or the Note, which obviously by the time my contract ends will be newer versions of both of these phones, the Samsung Galaxy and the Note. I love my iPhone 4S, but when the iPhone 5 came out there was nothing really different about the 4S and the 5. What do you think? No. Do not leave iPhone. You will regret it. Trust me. By then, there might even be iPhone 5S. Or 6. Keep your options open and see what's available at the time. The iPhone 5 does have differences. They may be subtle, but they are definite differences. You will see an improvement. Anyway, you guys let me know your opinions on that in the comments. What would you do? iPhone or Samsung, iPhone or Samsung, remember whose channel you're on. Don't forget to get your questions in for next week, you can ask here on YouTube. In the comments you can ask over on my Facebook like page, it's facebook.com forward slash Rachiebop off of YouTube and you could also ask on Twitter, use the hashtag AskRachieBop. Don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends and your enemies and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye! Hi guys, we're actually back here. This is so cool, it's so foggy. What happened? Oh, guys, I'm just, just starting from where we left off. Oh, aliens, aliens. I think it's aliens. I think this is definitely aliens. Oh my goodness, can I interact? Oh my goodness. I'm really excited. <gasps> oh, no! What?